Hey guys, so, um, lately I've had a couple of friends ask me how I get uh, Razor Game Booster to start recording videos. And the problem with that is they try to, uh, you know, they've got awesome badass gaming computers and this massive damn computer monitor and 1080p high def, all that. But they're wondering why they can't get Razer Game Boost to record their games. So, here, you're going to start up Razer Game Booster. You're going to go into Screencast. You want to make sure Screenshot and Video Capture are both toggled on. What you also want to keep into uh, keep in mind is your video resolution and your video quality first off those will impact the size of your videos substantially the highest video quality it's gonna make a pretty big file but that's one problem you've got screenshot or you actually just have screencast capture enabled entirely but it's not recording well, if you're like me, you can see I don't have very many games here. But I do have the Battle.net app. This is the problem with Razer Game Booster. There, it's had issues and it's not able to record 64-bit games, uh, game clients. So, to get it recording again, you switch it from 64-bit client to 32-bit client. And by doing that, it'll start recording. In Razer Game Booster, or not Razer Game Booster, Battle.net, as soon as it starts, there it goes. And give it a minute to... <sighs> Come on. I have a decent PC, there's no reason it should take this long. Okay. So, everything's loaded. You're going to go into your options. You're going to go into your game settings right here you're gonna click launch 32-bit client instead of 64-bit just for purposes of the argument click it it's gonna automatically save the change you can click done and get out of it so then you can click play on your game and I don't know if Diablo 3, no it does not um, Starcraft Hearthstone no. Well, World of Warcraft, though, especially because a lot of my friends play World of Warcraft and I only play because they play. Because it's boring playing World of Warcraft alone. Just uh, go into the game settings of the Battle.net app, and I highly suggest getting this because even though it's in beta, it's actually pretty, use pretty uh, useful. At well, useful and reliable. Blah, tongue twisting here. And just make sure you have Launch 32-Bit Client uh, checked. By doing that, you basically ensure that when you go into Razer Game Booster, your video capture button will now start recording. So, I hope that helped out a few people. If it didn't, leave me hate in the comments. I'm prepared. Other than that, have a good day.